give it something to eat. In Mark chapter 5 verses 35 to 43, we read about Jairus' daughter who was very sick and Jairus went to seek for help from Jesus. While on their way to the little girl, his servants came to him to tell him that she had died and he should not bother Jesus anymore. But Jesus still went and he restored the girl back to life. In verse 43, it says, But Jesus gave them strict orders not to tell anyone, and he said, Give her something to eat. Abraham Maslow developed a triangle to describe a human being's hierarchy of needs. According to Maslow, when a lower need is met, the next need on the hierarchy becomes our focus of attention. There are five levels of needs according to Maslow. The first is the physiological need. These needs refer to our basic needs such as food, water, sleep, air and shelter. The second level is a safety need, which is your personal security, employment and resources. The third level is love and belonging. This level is our need to feel loved and accepted and to love. The fourth level is esteem. When people's esteem needs are met, they feel confident and they see their contributions as achievements as valuable and important. However, when their esteem needs are not met, they may experience feelings of inferiority. The fifth level is self-actualization. This is when we feel fulfilled. When you actually realize why you exist and you fulfill that purpose. So what do you need to fulfill your purpose? You need food, resources, love, to be loved and to feel loved. Confidence and then you can fulfill your purpose. In the scripture, we read about Jairus' daughter who had died. This daughter can represent our goals or dreams that we set out in the beginning of the year but have since died. In verse 43, we see that hunger could have caused this girl's death as Jesus told the parents to give her food. Food, according to Maslow, is a basic need. Until you satisfy this need, you cannot progress to the next level of needs. Not feeding your dreams or your goals will kill it. Feed it by applying faith and corresponding action. So, believe in your goals. Then make effort to reach them. Ask for help. Practice whatever you set to practice. Do not give up. When you get a no, keep on knocking. First part of verses 43 says, But Jesus gave them strict orders not to tell anyone. You also need to find someone, a partner who will help you feed your dreams. Then don't tell anyone else. A goal partner who will not feel intimidated or insecure by your dreams. Someone who wants to see you succeed. These parents both wanted to see their daughter alive again. They were both concerned when she had died. You need a goal partner who will help you by going to help get help like Jarius did. Not everyone you tell your dreams to will help you feed it. So let's take Jesus' advice. He told the parents, the partners, do not tell anyone and give your dream, your goal, something to eat.